Hey guys, how you doing? Uh, day daily reptiles. Um, yes, the beard's been shaved. <clears throat> I'm gonna let it grow back a little bit. We'll see what happens. Um, we're gonna do a quick video today. Uh, about two days ago, I palpated my female, felt some eggs. Um, had my son come in, he did it, he felt it too. My youngest son, he felt them. Uh, just wanted to show you guys how we do it here. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. Pretty quick and easy. Uh, she's getting pretty small, it's getting pretty big. I know she's probably getting irritated because we've been doing it a couple days in a row now, but we'll get this one done and then we'll let her chill for a while. But what I do is I take Take the female, I get the tub closed a little bit and get her head going back in. Wait for her to start going that way. It has a little bit of pressure on the bottom and on the top. You squeeze a little bit and let her go and you'll feel the eggs as you get closer and closer. There's one, two, three, there's four, there's five, that's a big one. Six. Oh, there might be seven. Possibly an eight one, eighth one in there. But yeah, that's how we palpate them. We do that for all of them down there. Uh, I mean, it's not it's not 100% guaranteed, but I'm, I don't know too many things down the lower third of their body that's little balls in one, two, three, four, five, six, possibly a seven on that one. I didn't feel it last time. Um, yeah, I mean, we're excited. We're excited. That's one there. We have a, a lock down here. I might be able to pull the camera down and show you guys that here in a minute. And that's with our uh, GHI Mojave pinstripe uh, spot. That's his name. And then uh, our normal girl that we picked up from the show uh what was it last weekend weekend before last something like that uh quick update this is gonna be a quick short video i'm only at two minutes now uh quick update everything's growing everything's eating everything's pooping uh we had a new litter of babies from the rats yesterday possibly the day before i was working nights so my days are kind of jacked up a uh, day or two ago um let me push this guy in uh get ready to do a big cleaning in here it's a bunch of mess and Eventually, I'm getting this carpet pulled up in here and have it concrete. I'm gonna paint the walls, start getting it to look really nice in here. But wanted to get established and make every, make sure everything's rolling before I start putting a lot of time and effort into making the room look pretty. You know what I mean? Uh, trying to think if I'm missing anything. Yeah, babies are growing. I'm building another rack right now. Uh, next day or so, I'll have that done and put up. Uh, we got the babies from the last litters. They're about to be split up. And they're about four weeks of some change old and I'm running I got one more tub one more empty tub and these racks and I have six litters on the ground four three or four more pregnant moms so they're gonna it's gonna start rolling here quick I'm gonna get another rack put together that should buy me some much some more time before I got to get another one going um, but yeah I mean that's it that's really that's all that's going on the the hatchling hatchlings are doing great. Crescent gecko is doing great. Everything's rolling. Let me see if I can get you a shot of that, uh, the lock I got down here, if they're still locked up. They were locked up this morning. Um, we'll come down here. I gotta go slow, you know, they, I don't wanna spook them. Yep, and they're still locked up. It's our normal and our GHI Mojave pin going to town there. So hopefully, hopefully two more locks get them another lock and hopefully everything comes together I and mean, there's two clutches and i got a i got a female special vanilla who's really really close so maybe late season uh kevin our albino champagne i'll pull her out real quick she's getting close to i weighed her the other day she was uh oh thir almost 14 almost 1400 grams so she's not I mean, technically she can go right now, but we're not going to put her in there yet. I want to try to get her at least 16, 17. I'm going to put her with our uh, albino male. If he starts throwing on some weight real quick, a couple little breeding 
plans we have, you know, is the albino, the albino champagne. Use a soft spot. And a normal uh, Medusa was put to our bananas. Uh, special vanilla girl Courtney, I'm not sure what we're gonna put with her yet. Um, my pastel ghost is close. Uh, my black pastel, lesser fire, possible yellow belly, grumpy male. He's really close. Um, I got a pastel inchy orange dream yellow belly. Pretty close. That's a male. Uh, our females, we have three or four that are really close. Our banana pied, she's getting super close. Um, but yeah, a uh, quick video. This is a little update. What's going on? Show you how to palpate real quick. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments. Uh, follow us on Instagram, alien underscore reptiles. Um, goes to Facebook. Also, so if we don't have Instagram here on Facebook, you can you can check us out there and what we post and everything goes straight to that. Uh, but yeah, I think that's it. Um, oh, another update I got. I got another fan in here. Try to get some more air circulation. I got the one oscillating fan in the back. I'm not sure if you can see it. Yeah, right there. It's rolling back and forth, but I think I need a little bit more in here. Sorry, kind of getting a little musty, I guess. Kind of thick air. So I got that rolling, but uh, yeah. That's it. Uh, keep your head down. Positive mindset. Uh, keep grinding and uh, hope for good things for everybody in 2020. And uh, I'll talk to you guys next time. Have a good one.